We are here at Rockwood uh, Reservations. I wanted to get some more rocks to tumble because my rocks for us this park are almost done. Wow, but what about this online? As soon as we get here, look at this. Petrified wood. Oh my god, I'm so excited. That's pretty cool. So, I have a lot of good read. But there's a possibility of agates. I didn't know that we had that in Missouri. So, let's just look around and see what we can find. So this creek did flood really bad a couple weeks ago. Oh, look at that one. Different colors. That's cool. What is that? I don't know. That is look pretty cool. Could you... Here, I want to walk down there, but I don't want to fall. So come here and give me your hand. Oh, look at that one. Here, give me your hand. Oh, I'm gonna fall, aren't I? No. Yes. No falling. Okay. All right. No falling. Robert found the find of the day. That petrified wood. That was pretty awesome. I think I can find the running water in that creek. The possibility that we could find an arrowhead. Missouri had a lot of Native Americans at one time, so it's been known to happen. Wait, is that one? Is that an agate? I don't think so, but isn't as exciting as hunting for seashells, but unfortunately I'm in Missouri right now, so gotta work with what you have. I keep finding pieces of glass. Even so, I'm picking them up. See, is this is river glass a thing? I'm gonna make river glass a thing. I just found some river glass. <laughs> you know, like sea glass instead of river glass. Is that is that one an agate? No. I'm gonna be pretty rare to find agates because I've lived in Missouri my whole life, and Robert just read an article about it. I'm like, what? I 
found another piece of glass, Robert. Are you serious? Yes. Very natural. River glass. Did you see the natural springs over here? No. Pretty neat. The water is flowing out of the ground right there. Oh, I see what you're saying. It's not. It's not from this. It's going on its own because it. Sure. Isn't that pretty neat? That's very cool. Did you find? Did you find anything good? Yeah, I found all kinds of stuff. Cool. Can I get right there? Maybe. 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 It could be an elephant tooth. It's not. It Pretty sure be. there's never been an elephant tooth. Hey, a mastodon tooth. Oh, you're tooth. right. I totally forgot. Mastodons. mastodons have been found in Missouri. I don't think we're allowed to do that in mastodons. We can look, though. We can look. We don't just mean we need to take it. <laughs> then we can look. Find a tooth. Like a wild one. Tooth of a wild. Oh, that was a frog. Did you see that? He's like underneath. Where'd he go? I lost him. No, he's sitting on the ledge. He's underwater right there. I'll have to see if I can do video at night. The hike that we take at night around our non existent lake, <laughs> our subdivision has tons of frogs. We have to have flashlights the whole time so we don't accidentally step on frogs. So many frogs. It's a good thing no one really bikes that path because those frogs would be in danger for sure. Do you see him sitting on the ledge, Robert? Okay, see that straight ahead? You see that leaf on top? Yes. Go, half, go underneath the water halfway to the right. He's on That's that ledge. Him? Yeah, it's him. Oh, I see him. That's I guess funny. he is an aquatic frog. Oh, there oh, there he comes. He needed air. He's like, oh, that guy's watching me. I don't like it. I need air. Oh. Good looking frog. All right, let's go back to him. Let's go. A good looking frog. Yeah. Really, Robert? I amuse myself. You, you amuse us all. there. I walked. Really? Without getting your feet wet? I used this little bridgeway here. Hmm. I yeah. didn't say I didn't get wet. I'm not risking it. I just jumped. Ooh, some kind of Might as well jump. dried up rock so or dried up there. acorn. If you were in Florida they would call this a sea bean. Oh my god. Look at that. Another piece of river glass. Look, it even's like, even looks like sea glass because it's all like, what do you call it, Robert? Urban glass. This glass is all worn down. What is that called? Polished. Polished. Yes, from the natural. From the natural. Water. It's rocks. It's water. Does it matter if it's salt water or not? Does it really matter? Urban glass. So urban glass. Urban glass. I didn't realize. I was saying river glass, but I think I like the town urban glass better. Did you just hear a dog? Did you just? Or was it a bear? It could be a bear. It be a bear. There's not that many. Bears really aren't an issue, but. I said bears are not normally an issue. It could happen. They're not really like. There's some in the Ozarks. Ooh, that's very pretty. I realize bears could happen, but it's like a rarity. It's like getting bit by a shark in the ocean. It happens, but it's a rarity. There are some black bears in the Ozarks, but we are like four hours away from the Ozarks. I'm not seeing any agates, Robert. 
What is that? An agate? What is that? What is Ooh, and I lost it. I lost it. <sighs> what was that? I saw something cool and I dropped it. There it is. You know, for being a Wednesday afternoon, this park seems to be pretty popular. Yeah. We were working and we decided to take a break. Do a little rock hounding. And then we gotta go back to work. This is just our lunch break. This is park is like 15 minutes from our house, so the benefits of working from home. When you need a break, you can go to a beautiful park. And there's no boss saying, be back at a certain time. Except that's my boss right there. Robert, what time do we have to be home? What? What time do we have to be home? No. See? The perfect boss. He doesn't care. How do we get home? I gotta work. So don't... I gotta home. work too. I was just talking about how you're the perfect boss. Because you don't care when we get home. Because no, we, no. we went to lunch at Burger King and there was a lady. There was a lady behind us being like all like shift, like, what's the word? Antsy. And she's like, can I come in front of you? I gotta get a drink and I'm running out of time. I'm like, sure, I'm not in a hurry, go ahead. So, I guess her boss kept texting her cell phone wondering what was taking so long. Oh my god, he found another piece of petrified wood. I have went 40 years of my life without petrified wood and he's now found two pieces. That's pretty impressive. Pretty impressive indeed. Did I just date myself? Scratch that. I'm actually only 28. You have to be in a specific place at a specific time, but I always hated the bosses like who said, well, you still have to be here and, and that and you can't be flexible with the time. And that's why I don't want to work for anybody. Because it's like if I get my work done and I don't think it's good plants, then that's tough. Oh, look, look, this is an old... Don't miss it. Look at this. Oh, that's an old piece of... Pottery. When the Puritans landed here. Okay, it's not that bad. great ships. It's just you don't... <laughs> Did I mention that flood went through recently? That's why there's probably all the glass. The Puritans. Sorry, honey, this is not the Mayflower. I don't think there was Puritans in Missouri. Look at that one. How far from the coast? That's pretty. All right, that's it for now. I've already been recording for 12 minutes. I just wanted to show you what we're doing. We're gonna gather a couple more. I need a bag full so I can tumble. And then I will show you the tumbling process because it's a lot of fun. Hmm. What'd you find? Oh, it's just weird red and purple crap. That's pretty. It will be pretty, I'm sure. That's a native truck. That's a native, native blue truck. Yeah. Very common around here. Trucks. Trucks indeed. Yeah. <laughs> it is very good. 